Hello, it's Pamela, and I'm here today to talk to you about something near and dear to my heart, which is moisture that I use daily and a color correcting. And I'm going to be showing you a couple of products that I love, and they are not only in my kit, but they are also in my personal makeup drawer. Um, we'll get, jump right into this, and I will put a link to all of the products that I use below. The first thing I'm going to talk to you about today is Limelight's Must Do, which is a Palma Rose and Sunflower Oil. And it is, I use it as an additive with my sunscreen so that I can have a little more moisture. I also use it as a um, an aromatherapeutic product that just smells so good. That's divine. As we go, and y'all, excuse me, I'm just going to do this as I talk so you can see. Now, I also, I'm using this straight up today. I'm not applying it with anything else, any other um, moisturizer or anything. And then whatever is left over, I always rub into my hands. But I can't stress to you enough how much I love this product. Must do is my favorite of all the Limelight products, and I have a lot of favorites with them, but this is the one that I use daily. And the one that I find the most, um, that I'm able to incorporate with all the other products that I love from all the other lines that I love. Uh, so I would encourage you to leave me a message or inbox me or something to let me know if you'd like to try it, and I would be happy to put a sample of it in the mail to you so that you can enjoy it too. All right, my must-do is on. Um, my actual cosmetic issue that I want to address today, and I'm really bearing it all to you today, I have nothing on my face at all except for a couple of swipes of mascara on my upper lids in order to give me a little bit of presence. So what I really want to concentrate on is showing you um, what I do. I put my oil on, and now I'm going to use... Ket's Color Corrector Palette. Now this is a palette that I normally keep in my in my kit and I just wanted you to be able to see it. But these two light and light medium color correctors are at this point in the year, these are the two products that I mix together to get the right shade because I already have a little bit of sun. I've done a good job of keeping sun off my face but my neck and my decollete are starting to have a little bit more of a presence. And I just want you to watch what I do. I scrape a little bit of both. And this is important too because that this darker color, I don't know if you can see this or not, but I've got both of those colors on here. I'm going to put it on the back of my hand. This is how I mix it up. You can use your fingers with your own product. You can always use your own fingers. And now I'm going to go in, in these real dark areas, and you can see on me that it's my inner eye and right here. Is there anyone else who has that issue? Am I the only one? I might be. And I'm packing it on. And for those of you who like that Mario technique where you, or the Kim Kardashian Mario was her makeup artist. Um, Makeup by Mario. He came up with this little trick of applying in V's in order to, I mean, look, I, I'm not, I don't even have this blended in and what a great correction that already is, but this is going to get even better. Ket is my color corrector. I love this product. It has just enough orange in it that corrects all my dark brown. I've got brown purpley undertones under my eyes and it's that orange that straight up and again I am just sloppily kind of putting it on but I want you to see what a difference that is um, now I'm going to take my Esam brush vegan brush T45 and I'm going to start blending it all in some days I get a lot more involved. Other days I just go with this. 
and when I say much more involved, I will set it with a powder. Um, I love my Limelight Perfecting Powder. I also love Ket's Setting Powder. And both of those powders are a white powder that just help things stay put. But today, I'm not going to do anything. I'm, today's a Monday. I'm going to give my skin a break. I usually don't put on a full face on Monday. And I... Let me check over here in this lighted mirror. All right. And even with this, I feel like I can walk out of my house with this face. It's, it's not a full face. Um, I might put a little lip gloss on and go, but really, I really wanted you to see this color corrector. And no eyeshadow. Just that. But this, the must do is key in this because it helps emulsify and kind of sheer out this beautiful Ket color corrector and keeps a beautiful soft finish under my eyes. Well, I hope you learned something. I hope you enjoy it. I would love for you to try these products. My Limelight page it will have a link below. In addition, my online store will be featuring some cat products, including these color correctors. And I'm happy to um, help you through the color selection process. Drop me a line. You too can correct those darkness, er, dark areas. Y'all have a great day.